adding a Facebook chat messenger so your shoppers can chat directly with you and all this for free without the app. I'm gonna show you how to code it in this video. All right, let's just jump straight in. We're in our online store right here. And the first thing we're going to do is go to online store and then we're going to create a duplicate. This is super important. Do not skip this step or you're gonna be completely lost. So actions, duplicate. Then when you scroll down, it's going to be creating a duplicate of your theme and that's where we're going to do modifications. If we mistype something and the code breaks, then we don't care. It's on a backup version. We can just delete it and it doesn't affect our life store. If we do it here and it breaks, we're screwed. All right, now that's clear. Cool. We're going to go to actions and we're going to go to edit code. Welcome to the code editor. We're going to click on theme.liquid all the way up. And then what we're going to do is we're going to find the closing body tag. So command F on a Mac, control F on a window. We're going to do this little sign right here, slap forward slash body. And there we go. Here we have our closing body tag. So we're going to go right in front of that and we're going to type enter a couple of times. That's going to allow us to create some space. Spacing doesn't matter in HTML code. Once you have that, you're going to take the code in the description on the link below and you're going to paste that big block right there. Boom. It's actually not that big, but it should start with style and it should end with a script tag. So that's it. All you do right now is click save. Then you go back to your online store. And then this is the version we just worked on last saved just now. So we're going to do actions preview. And ta-da, you have the Facebook Messenger. Now this is linked to the Ecom Experts account. Um, so we just need to change which account it talks to. And we can easily do that by going back into the code, clicking on actions, edit code, and basically going back to the big code we pasted. This, scroll down a bit. So we go all the way down to the closing body tag right here. It's nicely commented. This is the code you're pasted. And let's see, right here you can change the position of where um, the little widget appears. So feel free to change that and Google how that works. But what we're really looking at is to change the URL to match your Facebook link. So all of this fun stuff is to change the, uh, the, the look of it. really annoying. But now we are looking for, but we want to be changing this right here. Everything that says Ecom Experts, you basically want to change it out with your own. So this is, should be your own URL. And then you can remove the, the quotes if you want. Um, and then you can remove basically all of, all of the things that say Ecom Experts. So you do Command F and you do Ecom expert I should I'm probably going to change this but you have all of the the yellow things there you you should change them out with your own company so let's say your uh your facebook url is my socks then uh this is probably your extension you go to facebook so this is our Facebook page URL, so that's obviously ours, but you would take your Facebook page URL and you would replace it right here. In the class Facebook page data RHF, you would replace it with your Facebook page URL. And then that's pretty much it. The last step that is left is putting your store live. So for that, you go to online store, you go to actions, you click on publish. Now you're going to ask you, are you sure you want to publish this? Yep, we're sure. And there we go. Now the live version will have the Facebook chat widget. And there you go. Now the live version has the Facebook chat widget to easily chat with your company and basically make your customer service much better and maybe even increase your order value. All the code is below if you just follow the first link in the description that way you don't have to pause the video and then kind of figure it out and maybe do a typo. So you just go on the first link, you copy paste everything. That's it. Thanks a lot. I'm Andrew and I'll see you in another video. Ciao.